What's up, everybody? I'm back with your monthly taroscope for Leo. The month of Leo, season of Leo, whatever you want to call it. It's July 22nd through August 22nd, and this is just what to expect. And on this one, we're going to do the sun and the houses since Leo rules the sun. So let's get started. If you have sun in the first house, you got the world and it represents Saturn. Your messages. Your main goal will be reached and your wishes will be transformed into reality. If you have Sun in the second house, you got Five of Pentacles reversed and your messages. Your financial hardships will finally be relieved. Yay! If you have Sun in the third house, you got the King of Wands reversed in your messages. Remember to be the first to withdraw from any argument. You'll only make the situation worse. If you have Sun in the fourth house, you got the Two of Cups, which is represented by Venus and Cancer. Your messages. You can look forward to signing a beneficial contract. If you have Sun in the fifth house, you got the star reversed. Your messages. If you ignore your inner voice, your goals that you're focused on right now will be delayed. If you have Sun in the sixth house, you have the six of cups, which is represented by Sun and Scorpio. Your messages, your past ambitions and dreams will be resurrected and will become your new goals in life. So something that you put off before that you've always wanted to do that you gave up on will come back to life. If you have sun in the seventh house, you got the ace of pentacles, which is represented by the earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Your messages, wealth, as well as material and physical comfort are in store for you. These are some pretty good messages, I would say. If you have Sun in the 8th house, you got the Seven of Swords reversed, which is represented by Moon and Aquarius. Your messages, keep in mind that victory is right around the corner, so don't give up. Don't do it. If you have Sun in the ninth house, you have the Hierophant, which is represented by Taurus. Your messages, an opportunity for a career advancement might happen, or a breakthrough in your consciousness will happen that will just completely destroy all of your spiritual arrogance and everything you thought you knew. So one of the two will happen. If you have Sun in the tenth house, you got the Knight of Cups. And your message is, your goal will be reached. <laughs> That's literally all I got out of that. Your goal will be reached. It will. If you have Sun in the 11th house, you got the Three of Cups reverse, which is represented by Mercury and Cancer. And your message is, if you dwell too much on your past, it's only going to bring more pain. So get it together and start going forward and stop looking back. If you have Sun in the 12th house, you got the Devil reversed, which is represented by Capricorn. Your message is a shocking situation will occur during this period that will reveal your inner persona and really just begin a new spiritual enlightenment for you so something good will come out of this shocking situation it'll help you so that's your tarot scope for the month of leo be sure to jot your message down and if you want to buy a reading from me just visit my website and i'll talk to you guys next month for virgo bye